So the main focus of today's lecture is on this concept of noise figure. So there are these uh, two confusing terms. Uh, one is the noise factor and one is the noise figure. Um, they're basically the same thing. Uh, the noise factor, factor is the ratio of the SNRs, like I mentioned before. And then the noise figure is the conversion of the noise factor into dB, uh, shown down here. So this expression here for the noise factor consists of a bunch of parameters, uh, F min, Rn, the characteristic impedance of the, the system, gamma opt, like I mentioned earlier on the Smith chart. These are all things that are theoretically defined in the data sheet for a given uh, transistor, but it is much more common for a noise figure to be referenced in terms of uh, dB. And for reference, a good noise figure is somewhere on the order of a dB. I've seen LNAs with noise figures of a, like a third of a dB. So let's take a quick look at an example from Appendix H in the text. So we have a low frequency pi model of a BJT shown here. Uh, we're told that the source has an RMS voltage of 25 millivolts uh, with a source impedance of 50 ohms. We say that the BJT has an input impedance of 200 ohms and a voltage uh, gain of 50. And it mentions a bandwidth of uh, 1 megahertz. So they give us some information here about the spectral noise uh, content of this particular BJT. And they're asking us to find the uh, signal to noise ratio uh, at the output. But uh, what I end up doing here is I end up finding the noise figure of this system. So to that end, the first thing we want to do is figure out the uh, input SNR. So we know that the signal to noise ratio is going to be the uh, signal, 25 millivolts, divided by the, uh, the thermal noise due to this 50 ohm resistor here, RS. And then when you plug in all the numbers, assuming that we're at room temperature here, we end up with a input signal to noise ratio of 88.775 dB. Next, we want to calculate the output SNR. So to that end, we use superposition, where we short the noise voltages, and we open circuit this current source here. Uh, we use our voltage divider rule to figure out the voltage across uh, Rn. Multiply that by the trans conductance here, GV, and we end up with a output voltage, a large signal output voltage of 1 volt. Next, we short this source. We determine the voltage across uh, this input resistor due to the noise. Again, we multiply that by the voltage gain here, and we end up with a value of 36.42 microvolts. Then the ratio of these two numbers uh, comes to 88.773 dB. So from these two SNR values, we can figure out the, the noise figure. So in dB, we just end up uh, subtracting one from the other, and we end up with a value of 0 0.0021 dB, which is extremely small. So the last thing I want to point out is that these noise sources here were placed at the input side of this BJT, and this is what is known as uh, input referred noise. So later on when we talk about uh, multi-stage amplifiers, uh, we'll see the concept of output referred noise.